If you're going to get started with blogging or if you're starting with your own affiliate marketing blog, there are some tools which I use it every day and I want to share it with you guys. Now the first tool is Flickover. Flickover is a tool which will help you to get all the paid tools which are very expensive for a cheaper rate. You can get it for 1000 or 1200 bucks and you will be getting tools like SEMrush, Ahrefs, Grammarly Premium, all these tools you can get it for 1200 bucks. If you're going to get started with blogging or affiliate marketing, one of the best tools out there is Ahrefs.com. Ahrefs.com can give you data like domain authority, page authority, the backlinks you have on your website and it can give you a lot of data. Apart from that, it can also give you data like what are the issues with your website. So if you're going to get started with affiliate marketing and a blogging website, this is a must have tool for you. The next tool is Quora. Now you're the one who is going to start with blogging and there are chances you won't have a lot of topics in your head. Now, if you want to read those topics or if you want to do some more research on it, then I will always suggest you to go with Quora, read the articles, what people are writing. And if you want to create backlinks, it is one of the best tool out there. So go to Quora, help people out there and make an audience. If you make an audience then there are chances you will get more and more visitors coming to your website. The fourth tool is Google Analytics. It is one of the most important tool out there, which will help you to get the statistical data of the users who are coming on your website. So basically you will get the data, like how many people are coming on your website. Are they spending more time on your website or not? And based on that, you can make a decision out of it. So for example, if the users are not spending a lot of time on your website, then you can try updating the article and try adding new things to it. The next tool is Gmas. Gmas is a tool which can help you to send customized emails to the users who are there on your website. So for example, if you're getting name, number, email ID of the users out there, then you can just add it in the Google sheet and you can send an email to them. The next plugin is add this. Addthis.com is a website which can help you to get social sharing buttons on your website. So if you're writing an amazing article and you don't have a social sharing button, there are chances people are not going to share those articles with their friends. So you need someone to share it, right? So that is the reason one of the best plugin out there is called addthis.com, which can help you to get more and more social shares on your website. If you're publishing a lot of articles on your website, you need stock images. Now, one of the best websites for stock images is unsplash.com and Pixabay. So you can download free images from their website and upload it on your site. Now you are someone who gets a lot of ideas while taking a shower or something else, then I will always suggest you to use Trello. Now, whenever I get an idea, I always keep a Trello on my phone or on my laptop. So let's say if you want to write a new article or if you want to stay organized, then I will always suggest you to use Trello.com. Now let's say you know how to get started with blogging, but you want to edit images, but you don't have enough knowledge to use Photoshop or Adobe Illustrator. Now here, you don't have to worry about these things because one of the best tool out there is Canva.com, which can help you to create any kind of image you want. With the help of Canva.com, you can edit images or if you want to make a new image from scratch, you can do it easily using Canva. Once you're starting with your website, I will always suggest you to create Facebook page, Facebook group, or if you want to create a LinkedIn company page, you can also get started with that. Now, let's say if you have a lot of social media handles on Instagram, Facebook, and to post it individually can take a lot of time. So I will suggest you to use a tool called as buffer.com, which can help you to schedule all your posts on social media. And if you want to post it at the right time, I will always suggest you to post it in the morning. Now, let's say you are someone who is interested in doing screen recording or publishing video content on YouTube. So you can use a tool called as Loom. Loom is a software which can help you to do a screen recording and it can also show your profile picture or a photo or a video as well from your webcam. So if you're into YouTube or if you're into screen recording, then I will always suggest you to use loom.com. Now this is the last one, but yet my favorite tool out there and that is gpldl.com. Now, if you're someone who is using WordPress and want to install premium plugins or themes on your website, then I will always suggest you to sign up with gpldl.com. Now this is a tool which can help you to get free premium plugins, themes and WooCommerce extensions. So you just need to create an account and start downloading premium plugins and themes. Now these were some of my favorite tools out there which helps me to do blogging and create content on YouTube. So if you're someone who wants to get started with blogging or affiliate marketing, I will always suggest you to go through this tool and get started. It can help you to save time and save money as well.